These are the fertile eggs of the hickory horn devil caterpillar, the largest caterpillar on earth, which take roughly 10 days to hatch under the right circumstances. The emerging caterpillar seen here has uninflated horns, or as I like to call them, headgear, but shortly after will fill out and begin looking for food. At this point, they are relatively delicate and will stay small through the first few sheds or instars. As they grow, they will hang from the leaves, trying to hide when resting. Here is a late stage caterpillar with perhaps one more shed to go before it turns into its fabulous blue color, followed by a distinct turquoise before pupating. At this stage, they're in their full thorny glory, although they are not at all dangerous and even their head spikes are rather bendable and soft. They're quite a sight to behold and their colors are reminiscent of shades of the sunset, no longer bothering to hide while foraging. And here you can see the yellow, green, and reddish orange on their pro legs, which are so strong it is nearly impossible to remove them from branches unless it is voluntary on their part. Here's a final look when ready to pupate in this beautiful turquoise green. And the resulting moth, the regal or royal walnut moth, what I consider the most beautiful of them all, looking more like a plushie than a live creature, and only on this earth for maybe two short weeks before it is gone forever.